And also, I've been meaning to do this. Shout out uh, my Spuggy Face Media. Shout out Spuggy Face Media. Very good. So I, I know that the content that's been ran and all the scheduled content, hey, we y'all gonna see what's going on, but you know what I'm saying? All it take is to have a real conversation, man. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I do take away you know what I mean? For the flash out. You know what I mean? We go, we go talk. Me and Spuggy, I don't want to ruin it. But yeah, shout out Spuggy Face. I know a lot of people are looking down at Brick Baby for switching his energy up like this so fast. But let's analyze what this possibly means. For starters, Brick Baby could be protecting himself and flashing his street wisdom by showing and proving to other members that he's willing to handle everything in the streets moving forward. So no more threats online. That doesn't seem likely, but it's still a possibility. On the other hand, Brick Baby could be giving Sporty Face all of those shoutouts and support because, behind the scenes, they really found a way to squash the drama. Most people on social media seem to want the drama and have no care about the communities that may get affected. But this is overall a great thing, regardless of the purpose behind it. Even if Brick Baby is setting up a play to make it look like he has no issues with Sporty Face, He's showing an example of how to keep your emotions in check while going through an intense experience. I honestly believe that both Sporty Face and Brick Baby needed to find a way to show unity rather than go to war, especially with the history behind their hoods. What do you all think? Is Brick Baby setting up a play? Or is this beef with Sporty Face over? Can we expect some upcoming Brick Baby and Sporty Face music or podcast collaborations?